have Raynaud's yeah, right Raynaud's. After, for years now, yeah. and so my hands are always cold, uh -huh. and even in the summertime they feel cold. Uh -huh. But um, we were driving in the car one time, and uh -huh. I suddenly said to my husband, "My hands are warm. I can feel it under my skin. They're warm. It's, <laughs> it's all the way through. Uh -huh. My hands are warm, uh -huh. and now I feel what it's like for." A normal person to have warm hands yeah. because I, I can't remember the last time they were warm. Mm -hmm. But now, often, mm -hmm. my hands are warm mm -hmm. and my whole body feels warm mm -hmm. inside. Inside, and yes. And I, I, I haven't had that. I can feel the warmth. <laughs> I can. Okay, so <clears throat> after I put the needle on Rebecca's foot and she feels the whole body warm up. And especially she look uh, after 20 minutes, her face or oh, even warmer, <laughs> her whole body, her hands, her feet are uh, all warm. And she, and you said you never. I, my hands are always cold. I uh, have Raynaud's and they're always cold, but uh, they're very warm right now. Uh -huh. And your whole body? Yeah, my whole body is warm. Today I came in. Um, with good news because for the first time I've take, taken my temperature all week long and for the first time in my life it was 98.6 every single time. My temperature has always been 97.4, 97.6 at the highest and the doctors always would comment that my temperature was too low but there was no way to fix it and so Suddenly, Dr. Joy had told me, oh, I can fix that. And I thought to myself, no, you can't. It's always 97.4. And I started taking it, and it was 98.6 every time. <laughs> Dear Dr. Joy, attached are the chart and graph of my ferritin levels and how they dropped to normal levels after I started seeing you. As you can see... When I had COVID in March of 2021, my ferritin levels had skyrocketed to 2,752. The normal range is 7.3, 270, 7. Although it decreased as I was recovering, from June 2nd, 21 to January 4th, 22, the next time I had my blood tested, it was climbing again in January 2022, and then when I tested again on April 12th, 23, it was a little higher but still close to double the maximum level. Then I started seeing you in March. In April of 2023, I got the new test results with the 443.9 reading and told you about it. You said you could lower it. My medical doctor said he had never heard of that being possible with ferritin levels, but I could try anything I wanted. So you began working with me, and now my newest results show that you did, indeed, lower the ferritina level within the normal range. Thank you so much of helping heal my body. Rebecca Shannon I went to Dr. Joy Yang after two years of frustration with the American medical system. I had a severe case of COVID in 2021 requiring hospitalization for six days. Ever since then, I have had insomnia, a constant cough, lethargy, muscle aches, headaches, and just overall exhaustion. I have always had low body temperature, 87 to 87.6, and Raynaud's, poor circulation to body extremities resulting in cold fingers and toes. My insomnia would sometimes mean that it would take four, five hours to fall asleep or occasionally not fall asleep at all. Sometimes I could fall asleep quickly and then wake up two or three hours later and stay awake until morning. I had only a few nights in the last two years wherein I had six hours of sleep. Dr. Yang said she could help me, but I had reservations about that. The only help my family doctor offered was sleeping pills, which only resulted in me feeling more exhausted the next day. But after my first treatment from Dr. Yang, I slept that night for seven hours and have slept well ever since then. I fall asleep immediately and wake up energetic. Last week I took my temperature four times throughout the week and every time it was 98.6. My blood is finally circulating as it should. My hands have always felt cold and for the first time that I can remember, I felt warm. I couldn't believe it. Dr. Yang's treatments have almost totally eliminated my cough with a liquid herbal treatment. Previously, only a strong cough syrup provided some relief, but it left me drowsy and unable to drive. Dr. Yang's treatment is giving me longer periods of no coughing without any side effects. I love it. In summary, I highly recommend Dr. Yang.
If she tells you she can help with your issues, you can be assured she will. I'm regaining my energy. Muscle pain is greatly reduced. I'm warm and sleeping well. In general, I'm feeling young again. I'm 76. Dr. Yang truly listens to your story and prepares a treatment plan specifically for you to get your body back in balance naturally.